Hey, aloha Friday, and welcome again to the Free Surf News Desk, beaming right here on the North Shore of Oahu on the Seven Mile Miracle. I'm Mike Latronic. And I'm Shannon Reporting, and here are today's top headlines. John John Florence has pulled out of the remaining Australia events after sustaining a knee injury during competition in Margaret River. He's focused on recovering before the upcoming Summer Olympics planned for July 2021. But in the off chance that he's not able to compete in Tokyo, who would replace him on the U.S. Olympic surf team? Well, the good news is the talent pool in America and Hawaii is deep. You know, since Kolo Andino is also injured, Kelly Slater would be in line, our 11-time world champion followed by Hawaii's own Seth Moniz. So between Kelly, Seth, and Carissa, wow, Hawaii is gonna be represented at the Olympics no matter what. Congrats are in order for Kawaii girl Tatiana Weston Webb, who took down the local favorite Bronte McCauley and Stephanie Gilmore in the final to win Margaret River. Brazilian Storm's Felipe Toledo claimed the trophy in the men's division. In local news, registration is now open for the first ever virtual TNC Surf Grom contest presented by Free Surf Magazine. Limited to the first 250 groms, ages six through 12, in shortboard, longboard, and bodyboard divisions, 10 bucks secures your spot with 100% of these proceeds going to benefit the Boys and Girls Club of Hawaii. Sign up today, visit events.tncsurf.com. Getting outside of the Hawaiian Islands, it's time to talk travel. We had an exclusive interview with World Safari Sean Walker to ask about the possibilities of surf trips as countries reopen their borders to tourism. His top pick was the Maldives, because with a negative COVID test, you could potentially surf the Indian Ocean less crowded than ever before. Visit worldsafaris.com to book your next adventure. And last but not least, the new edition of Free Surf Magazine is the photo issue. And check out the breathtaking cover by Mike Coots. It's amazing. There's a lot of great photography in there from a variety of different shooters, men and women. So we urge you to pick that up at your local surf shop or, of course, uh, order subscription online. Either way, enjoy Free Surf Magazine. Thanks for supporting the last monthly surf magazine in the country.